Okay, here's the peat cipher for the recycled challenges. So maybe any time that I have a peat cipher challenge for you. So you'll see that there's three main parts. There's the blue code ring, there's the yellow clue ring, and then there's the rocker that has a hole to see one code letter and one clue letter at the same time. Okay. So, <clears throat> the first thing you're going to do to get a clue is you're going to that's going to give us a equals some letter. Okay? So that'll be the a clue is going to equal some letter in the code. So, let's say that a equals f. Okay? So I'm gonna, first I'm going to do I'm going to say a I'm going to change that to f. See how a and f are right here. So, if when I get a clue word, let's say it's alphabet, or maybe a better, easier one, apple, okay, A equals F. Can you see that? Looks good. So you're going to get some sort of clue, and the clue is an English word, and it can be anything that's at least five letters long to open up the codex because there's five rows on the codex so let's say the clue is what's your favorite class well your favorite class should definitely be science so we're gonna put in science so what's the first letter s so our, on the yellow the clue we're gonna go set that to s so that means that the code is going to be Y. Okay, so Y, what's the next letter in science? C. So we're going to rock that over to C. And then C equals G. So we got Y, G is our first two letters of the code. SCI. I equals N. So we got Y, G, N, and then we're going to E. Where's the E on this guy? Here it is. E equals C. And then finally, the last letter is N, is K. Okay. So science would be Y, G, N, C, K. Now you're going to get some letters from the recycle challenge. Do those letters match up with what you're given? They should. You really only need one to confirm that you have the right word. And then you can try that and add it to the form. You can try the form as many times as you want. Good luck in opening the codex.